day 12. A couple more days is going to be day 14. My hair's not cooperating today. Do I care? No. <laughs> uh, checking out my jacket. I barely need to lose any weight. I almost can breathe. <laughs> Oh, well, you know, my day starts early. Um, I had somebody say, uh, saying that uh, wants to know if something could be reason for her not wanting to start. The reason was a uh, woman related to any male fans are out there. You're going to hear it as an excuse. I do blame the moon on excuses because of the magnetic pull. Ask anybody who's in a rain and their joints hurt. So I think the moon might have something to do with it, but as far as your uh, woman's cycle, I just say men beware, <laughs> and it's an excuse, or is it? Let's talk about excuses. From what I'm hearing is that you're not exactly ready to begin, um, because it's like, oh, I'm going to try to walk. You know, not the word try. How about I will walk 30 minutes a day? How hard is that? Is it really hard? Take your little phone, if you have it, you pretty much all do. Take a timer, walk 15 minutes that way, and walk 15 minutes back. No brainer. For me, anyway. Because I like to walk, and I have a bad knee. So, I don't say, oh, I got a bad leg, I can't walk, I can't walk. I, oh, I think how I wore up my knee was from being overweight. Let that sink in. You need to move. Your body's designed to move. Um, somebody says, I can't walk today and I can't eat right today. I just don't have the energy. Heard that? Pass this week. I said, well, I got news for you. If you move and you eat healthy, you're going to find out how cool that is. I, mean, I use the word cool. I don't know. When you eat right and you move, you get energy. When you eat superfoods, you get more energy. Take a multivitamin, maybe, you know, um, that sometimes might fill in the little gaps if you don't know what you're doing. So, and your body's only going to absorb what it needs. The rest is going to just go out, you know. Um, so, so like, today is an excuse. Um, I, I'm, I'm doing three things right now. I'm doing my 100-day video. I've, uh, on Monday, I started a contest in the community, and today is a start for my cupcakes uh, group. Not to eat. Cupcakes Anonymous for people who wanted to eat. You know, sound familiar? Hi. You know? Uh, I don't know where I can name. It just came to me, and uh, so I'm here. So I'm here to say uh, my weight. Uh, the, see, the thing, funny thing about weight. My weight is up from my, my little mini road trip, point eight. And that's a fluctuation. That's why you probably shouldn't watch it every day. Stick to once a week. As long as you uh, do everything you should in a weekly period, at the end of the week, it's going to make a difference. And if you don't peek at it every day, it's going to be a surprise. Because I've been nothing but surprised thinking I had a bad week. And then it's like, oh, no, I... Well, I was like, how did I do that? How did this happen? Well, if you try, every chance you get so that the, um, when you have that reward meal, you'd be saying, wow, you know, I just uh, did really well and I had my one reward meal and I moved every day and I took my day off and, and maybe this week because of something you, you had, you can't take two days you, you might take two days. But, you know, life is going to happen. Don't beat yourself up for it. Because if you look at where I started on um, Monday uh, challenge, my weight is already down. So, so, like, I have different start mechanisms, and that just shows you how if you have one thing going and it's not quite right, what is your unit of measurement, which is what I always talk about, the measurement is you and the value you put on yourself. You are worth every penny. Can you imagine that? All you have to do is treat yourself really well. 
and and be a little bit selfish. You know, too often we're too given for other people. And then too often we just don't take care of ourselves. Right now, January, everybody wants to start. I went to the gym the other day. Not what you think. I wasn't there working out. I like to walk. I'm thinking about going to the gym, though, because I want a better body. But I need to lose a little weight first. I'm so heavy. I still got a bad knee. I don't want to be blowing my knee out again. One time when I blew it out there originally, uh, time, I had to wear a brace on my leg, and uh, I wasn't allowed to go up and down stairs. Uh, it was such a bad blowout, and I, and I was training for this competition. I was going to be going down to Arizona in the States. And, and I really felt I was a good compend, uh, compender, a con contender. And it w was pretty much a free trip. And I just uh, took six months off while I was at university. Uh, I said I need to focus on school and graduating, which I did. And uh, when I went to go work out, because they said, if you're serious, you're going to be there this Saturday. And I was serious. And I hadn't ran or anything in six months. And I was so happy that I just kept up. I might have been a little bit behind, but I kept doing it more than most people who, who wants to run two kilometers, which it was not. It turned out to be two miles, which is longer than two kilometers. And that's where I blew my knee out. And that really hurt. And I didn't know what was going on. I had to wear a brace for six months. Was long going up and down the stairs. I couldn't go for a walk with my friends. For six months, I had to look out that window, wear that brace every night and not walk I had let it heal and it was slow to heal because of the type of injury I had I brought it on myself that's why I say anybody's going to start this journey talk to your doctor make sure you're doing what you can do to um, to get moving but don't overdo it to the point you injure yourself because I have pushed myself and that still bothers me to this day that I actually missed out on that trip to go uh, compete and Nothing you can do, but now that's just life. Maybe it wasn't my, my calling to go. So um, be good to yourself, please. Remember the, 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 the chatter in your head that you're not good enough, that you can't do this. It's negative thoughts. And what I want you to do is say, not today. I'm going to erase you, negative thoughts, out of my mind. And I'm going to focus on myself. Focus that this is a journey. See you tomorrow. Like, subscribe, press notification. Don't make me say this every day. Watch my other ones, my other channels.